There's the river. Let's get through it. She's a fast moving one. I think I had to uh, winch out last time. Oh, we rolled. Hello and welcome to FJS717 YouTube. So I'm making this video because I was picking up the Spin Tires Mud Runner, and I played on hardcore before the before the regular mode, and I was having a really tough time figuring out, and I couldn't look up, I couldn't figure out how to look up anywhere online how to load the logs onto the truck properly, or how many logs I needed, or any and all of that. So I started a new game here in the bog. Uh, I think I'm still in hardcore, and. Uh, I'll do the I'll do the rig I was working with first. I had the where was it? I had the log. Is that one with the trailer, with the short log trailer. I'm gonna head over to the log dumping area and uh, get this thing popping. Okay, when running the loader, I like to run it in automatic so I can quickly switch between forwards and reverse. So you press down on the right joystick and move over to automatic. And then uh, the controls on it are a little bit funky, I find. So it's it's a slow process, it's a grind. But you get lined up with your, uh, your log kiosk. And you uh, press up and X on loader to bring up your load grabber. And then lower it down to the ground roughly. Get yourself centered and up to the log kiosk. It's a little difficult. I kind of use the side angle. And then do your final adjustment left and right. To select your logs, you press up and right. And for the small load, it's the small logs. I hit it once and twice to put four on there. Sometimes if you load too much, I feel like it glitches, then it'll only dish you out dish out one log. So you circle out. So then there's there's the medium logs and the long logs, which uh, we're not gonna worry about those. Short logs. So you pull up to it, or he breaks off. If you can slide your forks under without readjusting, do that, adjust left and right as necessary. Get under, hit up, and X. Grab them with triangle, pull back on your rig. I like to go all the way up and maybe out a little bit to clear the sideboards of the truck. Then you exit that, you back her on up. Get lined up, don't hit your headache rack. Don't leave them too far out the back. I'm a bit far to the right. Let's see if we can straighten that out in time. There we go. It's not a real truck, so you don't gotta worry about hitting it. Switch to your advance, bring up your loader thing, tilt them down, and release. Tilt it back up. Now we'll go and load the trailer. So it takes, it seems to take just one scoop of four logs. Which is nice and simple, keeps it easy. You know, not like when I was first having problems, I was like, oh, I gotta load it up all the way, like the thing. But I'm like, how do I get the strap over it then? Try and get squared up. Lower it. Get in there and select some more logs. Up, right, X, hold twice, cancel, pull in, scoop, grab, lift, reverse, and let's get them in that trailer. Now I did find one of the long log trailers. Uh, 
I, I was looking too quickly and I pressed a button and I had my logs on it and it lifted it up into you and it spilt my load. So you gotta watch so you don't do that on the log, long log trailer. I'm a bit low here. Oh, there we go, there we go, that's gonna work. Uh, up and this, dump and release. Uh, let's back up a bit. And we'll try lifting again. There we go. Alright, so let's get this out of the way, park it. Alright, so you gotta have the engine on to do this. So hit your throttle, release your park brake. And then I do them as quickly as I can. So you can always do the first one first. So you press up, and you see those green dots? That's what you want. You want the right number of those. Then you press right on the D-pad. That's right on the directional pad. That's the one on the left. This, this is the PS4 controls. I should have said that at the start, pardon me. So CS is ready to pack. X would pack short logs for three points. So you hit X and boom, you're done. And for your trailer, you press up and press right. And it says position your truck properly and it indicates to you that it's gotta go in the direction of the arrows or something like that. So you pull ahead. You pull ahead so it's straight directly behind you and as flat as possible and then it works and then I'll show you how to detach the trailer too because I had a hard time figuring that out we're not really lined up here but let's try it so up right ready to pack golden there you go now you take those off onto your to your lumber mill and you're set two loads of those and you're done or one of, the, one of those and one empty and you're done. So to do your trailer, or in your headlights or L1, that took me a long time to figure out. Trailer, cam, oh it's all hard in the darkness here now. Um, so what are we doing? We're detaching the trailer, so you press up. Oh, retaching the trailer, right. So say you accidentally detached your trailer. Uh, lining up's not gonna happen in the dark, so I'm just gonna leave it where it is. You do the same thing as loading your logs, you press up. And then you see the dot there, that means you can detach it or something, or attach it. Then you press right and it says attach short log trailer. And that's that. I'm gonna leave, if I can find it, the footage of me rescuing that rollover at the start. So stay tuned for that. And feel free to hit me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash FJS717. I'm generally live three hours a night after work. That's from 7 until 10 p.m. on weekdays in capital P, S, and T, Pacific Standard Time, or whatever that is, Pacific Time. All right, this is FG out. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped. If it didn't, I guess hit me. I might not be able to get back to you. I got a lot of time I spend doing concrete and uh, other stuff. But, yeah, we'll see what we can work out. All right, this is FG signing out. Thank you, and have a good night. Take our momentum and cross this river. Hopefully, please. Am I really gonna get washed out? <clears throat> oh my gosh, I'm gonna get washed out. I'm so washed out. Is there anything to winch onto? There's nothing. Set the e-brake. Shut the engine off. Is she moving? Uh, yes, she is moving.
Oh, we forgot to repair. Shut the engine off and repair. Does this plateau out? Does it let us? Or does this wash us out to the ocean? Oh, the park brake's still on, that's why. Where's the drop off? Oh no. Oh no, we're getting deeper. We're still moving out. My pilot doesn't drown, really? My driver? Can we grapple that log? That rock, I mean? Boy, it's gonna let me start the engine down there. Uh, winch. Negative, negative. Okay, let's stop the engine. 43 damage. Oh, wow. Oh, she instantly hit full damage. That's okay. Okay, let's, uh, well, if she stays there long enough, we can, uh, we can save her. Um, we're definitely going to want the loader there, so let's bring it first. Looks like a shorter route if we go down this road. Oh, I hate driving this thing. Now if we follow the beach, I believe this way, we should find our rig. Oh, there she is. Now the goal is to not get this rig caught in the current. Wow, that's a long ways. And we're getting closer to the current. I can hear the current. I kind of want to bring my anchor here, but I don't want to waste the time. It didn't get deeper for it. It's not going to get deeper. Dangerous water level. One thing we do not want to do is get our loader stuck. I got it stuck on the last map, and I was lucky to get it unstuck. I really want to just go in a little bit farther. What's the D535? That'll do. Oh, this thing just eats its way through that river.
Maybe I should just take that one. Oh nice, I think I'm pulling on it. The flames out the staff. Love it. Fisherman, nice. Let's get a repair rig over here. Everything is tore up. Thank you for tuning in to FJS 717 YouTube. Happy surfing.